You know, after I left the mansion, I went into therapy and realized that, you know, that place messed me up more than I thought it did. And mm. It was time to talk about it. I would see these women and think, wow, they're powerful. They have the world at their feet. And I would idolize them. I mean, it was like being at one of Caligula's orgies. It felt quite glamorous, didn't feel massively sleazy. And yet your book and other books by a number of the playmates paint a picture of a really dark, sleazy underbelly that was going on really around Hugh Hefner. It was disgusting. The yeah. house was disgusting. It was full of mold. I got very sick. Um, it was like a time capsule from the 70s that never got referred. When you I mean, I grew up with no money. I was apartment to apartment. You know, I walk in and I see like carved wood and all these mm. beautiful ornate things. and. It was beautiful. And every, this is, I thought, oh, this is how the other half live. And celebrities and Hugh Hefner and the media idolized him at that time. The world idolized him. His staff idolized him. <laughs> but the celebrities that were there so often all the time, mm. they were more of like the sleazy pervert kind. The twins were only 19 at the time and they're doing terribly now, so it's hard.